Hello, I'm Annette. Uh, maybe some of you know me, yeah, from ex Heathlands. I'm the crazy German, as Pippa always says. I haven't got automatic clothes on me today, but uh, yeah, and no gardening uh, equipment on my shoulders, but I'm surrounded by green. How wonderful is that? So I'm bringing you for today and the next few weeks a uh, Bad Wan Chin Chin Gong practice, which is a, a form of Tai Chi. Um, it's called the Eight Brocades. Unlike a Tai Chi, where you have a flowing motion, so like a dance, the Qigong practice are individual movements to elim eliminate the thousand or hundred illnesses in the body and the mind. So, um, yes, it, I will try to explain how we do it step by step and then we are uh, possibly doing it together, um, three. So um, I do them in summer, in my gym jumps. I'm just going out of coming, yeah, waking up in the mornings and I crawl up with you know, sleepy eyes into the garden and do my April cakes. Standing up in you know, pyjamas, uh, it's only good when the and the hedges are green because otherwise everybody sees me. However, it's really cool. I like it and I like the start of my day with these April kids. Um, now, uh, when we do the exercise, important is that when anything hurts, like pain hurt, ah, oh, don't do it, you know, we, stop it, don't do it. If you can't do it, alter it a little. If you can't get your arms up like that, do it halfway. Just do it as you can with your abilities. We are all different, aren't we? So, you know, some, some are not as flexible as others. Yeah. So there's a difference between a pain, like, ooh, no, uh, my arm, or something like, ooh, fatigue, like, you yeah, bodybuilding, or I'm doing strenuous exercise all the time and all of a sudden the muscle says oh ah, i can't do anymore and then you let go that's a different that different pain okay that is when the muscle has worked too hard you feel it so uh the difference between sharp oh, no 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 i'm not doing it so you you are in control you know your body you feel your body i i'm not there uh, unfortunately to help you out with that Okay, have I got, have I forgotten anything? No, perfect. Right, so then we can start with our first uh, brocade, okay? This brocade is two hands support the heavens. Um, this is a uh, exercise where it goes with an upwards movement both hands like you make a funnel you interlock your hands and then you stretch with your hands towards the ceiling ah you stretch and maybe you go a little bit backwards with your shoulders as well that's that's the movement and then you go slowly down. I show it one more time. So you come from the middle, you guide both hands up parallel to each other. In front of your face, you're kind of interlocking. Then you turn your palms towards the ceiling and you stretch. Uh, okay, this movement is good for the triple heat tap, which is kind of the, the thermal thermostat of your body, which keeps everything in control so that you're not overly nosy or too aloof or too, yeah, that, that you are uh, yeah, appropriate at any given time, really. Um, 
which is good for the shoulder circulations and the whole body circulation too. So, I, let's do two, uh, three together, okay? So, Breathe out on the way down. One more. Breathe in. Interlock. Stretch. Breathe out. Oh, last one. Oh. Interlock. Stretch on the head. And breathe out. Any of the brocades you just clear for the next one. Uh, there. Right, the second brocade is drawing the bow and shooting the golden eagle. Not that we are going to, but just the movement. Okay, this is a bit more complex. Right, we start by pulling our shoulders back, breast out, then we are making a cross in front of our bodies, then we are pulling as if you have a bow and arrow in your hand. You're pulling the string of our bow backwards and the aim is in front of us where the bow is so we are concentrating the arms are up the finger is up we are focusing on the finger then goes on then we are opening our other arm and we are following with the gaze the other arm then we bring back our arms into, into the body again, stretching our elbows back and we're doing the cross in front. Now, the, the aim will be on that side, so okay, we are opening up and we pull our string back into this side. Elbows up, fingers up, concentrating on the finger. Now we open on that side and we bring both arms back into the body, elbows pulled backwards. Okay, so it's both sides, that's one movement, okay? And it's on, on both sides pointed. Okay, right, this is concentrating on the liver. Okay, but uh, also um, the eye is really concentrating when you're focusing on something. So it's good for your true inten intention and your heart's desire so that you are, yeah, you're true to, true to your aim if you want. And it's good for the lungs, the breathing. Okay, right, let's do two of them, both sides, okay? Right, we start. Arrow, the arms back, close. A, open up. Both arms back. Okay. Breathe in. Breathe out. Oops. Wrong side. <laughs> Open up. Breathe in. And breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, breathe out, 
in and breathe out. Okay. And we let this one go as well and clear. Good. That was your second brocade. Right, so the next brocade is separate he heaven and earth. And we do that by supporting the heaven with the palm up and pressing down on the earth. Okay, it's like pressing on the ceiling and pressing on the floor. Imagine. Then we breathe in on our way, then we change. The one which went down goes up and the one which went up goes down and we breathe out, okay? And then we breathe in and we breathe out, okay? So this exercise is strengthening your inner core, yeah? So the whole muscles here are uh, trained um, that brings you into balance in your head and uh, yeah, physically and mentally. So if you're mentally out of balance, you are more needy and more yeah, insecure. Um, so if the body is in balance, your mind will be. Okay? Right, let's try three of them together. Okay? And we Breathe out, breathe in, breathe out, breathe in. One. That's it. And we clear this area for the next exercise. Thank you. Right, the next brocade is the wise owl who is gazing backwards. Okay, so imagine you have wings, your hands are wings, and you breathe out and you open your wings, and while you open your wings, you bring your chest forward and you stretch your neck backwards, and then you breathe in on the way forward, and you breathe out. Well, you open your wings again, widely, arms back, neck stretch, chest forward. Oh, okay, so this one is good for a good stretch in the neck area and, uh, and at all. I, I, I quite like it really. Yeah? It, yeah. So, let's, let's do two on each side. Okay? Okay. And open, breathe out, stretch. Come back to the middle. And breathe out and stretch to that side. Come back to the middle. And breathe out. And breathe out. Right, well done. And we clear this again to make room for the next exercise. Well done. Right, the 
next one is Big Bear sways from side to side. Okay, so imagine Big Bear moving your legs if you can, and then move a bit forward on your seat if you can. Hands are on your knees, and then you're moving forward, Big Bear, Whoa. going from side to side. Stretching over, seeing what's over there, and then he comes back, and then he goes down on the other side. Oh, like that. Okay. Did you see uh, enough? Do I need to tell you? It's this whole control that you don't tipple over forward, like, uh, you, you know, that you still uh, sit on comfortably on the chair. Um, and when you come up on the side, you just give it a little bit to that side. Oh, okay, let's try them. Uh, we say four pendulas, okay? One, two, three, four. Let's go. And down, over, over, stretch, and then we go up. Over, oh, breathe out, breathe in on the way up, and breathe out, Whoa. you can growl a bit if you like, and breathe out, on the chest, creaking again, yeah, one more, so, oh. one more back, and, yeah, Good. So that is good for heart and lungs and everything. Yes. Okay. I haven't. I haven't cleared. <laughs> My assistant Mark is sitting over there, and he did the motion. Oh, I haven't cleared the space. Okay. Yes. Absolutely right. So it's good for lung and heart and uh, yeah, overall movability. It's as well very good for your bowel system. I'm not talking about that now, but yeah, overall it's good exercise. Very good. Right, next one is punching with the angry face. Okay, so this is an exercise to get let go of inappropriate anger. You know, we all get angry and sometimes getting angry is, is a normal and good thing but sometimes it's just hindering, isn't it, in our daily life. So, we want to let go of inappropriate anger, we do this exercise. So, first of all, I want you to make a fierce face, an angry face, Whoa. right? Then you lift your fist up. Oh, the, the hands open, fist like this, so. And then you punch slowly and control forward. Whoa. Okay, you stop it, then you bring it back. Okay, the anger, well, the good bits back. And we punch the other fist forward. We stop, bring our anger in it, under control, okay? Let's do a few times this boxing for the fierce face. Don't go too fast, very slow. <sighs> Breathe out, stop. Bring it back. <sighs> stop. Bring it back. Again. <sighs> stop. Stop. Bring it back. Both sides. Stop. Bring it back. And one more time. Forward. Stop. Bring it back. And. And bring it back. And we clear. Whoa. Yes, that was good. The next brocade is called Two Hands Hold the Feet to Strengthen the Kidneys. 
Okay. The kidneys are sitting here in our bodies. Okay. So the exercise goes like that. So you hold both hands on the kidneys. Then you slide down on your bum on the outside of your legs. Hold your fingers on it. It's actually quite nice if you feel your fingers running down the side of your legs. You're touching your toes if you can. Then you're going on the inside of the leg. Up, 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 up. Then you leave the body. Make a parallel funnel to the sky. And you bring back the energy of the universe into your kidneys. Okay, so that's the move movement. It's good to take the energy from Mother Earth who feeds us and who carries us and who nourishes us into our body and we take all the help we get from the universe into our bodies too. So it's a true helping hand. Makes you more yeah. Standing with both feet on the ground. Something like that. Okay, uh, let's do it three times. Okay, hands on the kidneys. Slide down on the side of your legs. Round your feet up on the inside of your leg. Make your funnel. Breathe out. <sighs> now, before you breathe in, and then on the way down, you breathe out. <sighs> down. You breathe in on the inside. Hold your breath, stretch away, hold your breath, and then you breathe out on the way down. You breathe in. Kidneys, bone, thighs, lower legs, feet, inside leg, up, up, funnel, hold your breath. And when you open the arms and breathe out, one more time, kidney, boom, outside, down, feet, inside, inside leg, funnel, holy breath, and breathe out. Okay, and we clear that as well. Right, the last uh, brocade, which is always the last one, is to well, uh, to shake up the chi again, uh, to smooth everything in the body, you know, because we were bending and boggling and making all these exercises. So the last one is always is bringing it all back to normal. So we are shaking our body more or less. And there are different techniques, so you can either lift the um, uh, um, shoulders to your ears and you let them go and shake your body, yeah? You lift them and shake them. Okay, if you can't do that, you just give your whole body shake, 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 shake the arms, shake your body, yeah, whip around and ideally you would give it as well a little drink forward and backwards and then a shake and forward and backwards and a shake okay you want to try it i hope you you watch so far okay a little um uh bend forward and hear your spine twisting and turning and then up and blah. Okay, we do that four times normally, but because we've done already so many, we only do three. One, and one more, and forward, and backwards. Shoulders up, and shake it. 
Okay, we let it go. And now, with that, we can start our day, couldn't we?